Hey, Jack. Yeah? What's it's that? It's the stone mask. <laughs> oh. Wait, is that... Is that a stand on his shoulder? Sure, that's a stand. What the... Or... That's a Twilight thing. <laughs> Still doing Majora highlights. Alright, Ratchet and Clank. That's the agenda today. And, uh, hopefully... I don't... I think we're... I think we're gonna be able to finish. I think we only have a little bit left. But I've been wrong before. Yeah, this game's long. Give me a moment, I'll, I'll get it set up. Uh, oh, yeah, probably, uh... <laughs> we, get, we need to close the disc case. I wish, I wish we could do that without the PS2 automatically starting, but it likes to do that. Yeah, it does. I guess if we go to browse, we could, we could set it up like that. Yeah, we could. But I like seeing uh, the lights we'll go off. Then we'll expose our memory card. <laughs> oh no, people are going to steal our memory card through the internet. It's scandalous. You don't show people your memory card. Is that, is that true? No. Is that like a like like games gone wild post is just a person's memory card? Everybody upvotes it and they're just like uh, the fucking tear marks with the uh, fucking cucumber it's or got, not cucumber. It's got clan. the big rigs racing on it. It's got. Well, that's how you know they. they, they yeah, if, it's got big, if it's got big rigs racing on it, that's how you know they're really naughty. <laughs> oh, you're. Oh, th <laughs> that's how you know your memory card's thick. So Jack you got you got right the now. you got the stuff right. Uh, yes, off off stream, I have uh, cleared out all of the desert and tundra crystals. Cool. Where are we now? We should be on the tundra because I did not uh, I did not give the crystals to the guy because I didn't want to miss a cutscene. All right. So we're gonna we're gonna find out how much those many deaths were worth. It's not how even many? worth fighting the things out there. It's just flying around on your on your boots. Dodging them and only killing the dragons. Damn. Uh, oh this no, we're, why tundra. are we here? This isn't the tundra. Okay, I guess we'd better go to the tundra. Am I on the right? Did I choose the right file? Maybe not. It's Top number four. Not. Oh, this one? Yeah. Alright. Sorry. <laughs> Alright, now we're going to the tundra! Also, uh, some levels weaponed up. Uh, weaponed up. <laughs> some levels they weaponed we up while uh, in the tundra. Some levels have chosen a weapon to inhabit by proving themselves worthy. This late in the game, even getting all the desert crystals was only enough to get the uh, the shield charger. Ah. So those uh, those depreciate quickly. So all our weapons are leveled up. We did. Oh, not all of them. The shield charger is still leveling. Hover bomb still leveling. Probably not going to use the shield charger much. Yeah. Well, it's it's all right for uh, planets coming up. Big throngs of enemies. It's useful for, right. and it's useful as a shield. You can uh, pause and go to the weapons and see what we've got. Right. Uh, Sheepinator leveled up. What does that do? Black uh, Sheepinator. Exploding sheep. Okay. Tank bot. We've seen that. Plasma oh. storm. So we we have all the weapons. Uh yes. Somehow, well, except for the except for the Zodiac, the Rhino two, and. and... I don't know what the last one is. What is the last one? The fuck? Is it just is that just gonna be empty forever? I'm sure it's something. Get the Alright, here, here's what I'll do. Uh click select. Uh, instead of the mega I w I I kinda uh, Set it up however you want. Let's cannon. Right. The hub the hover bomb is is strong, it's just very slow. And not huge. Good for groups of enemies. Yeah. Trade 16. Oh. Uh, hello? We've got more moonstones. No, you have not. What? Existence is a lie. Sensations are illusions. Possessions are merely visions. All right, I've got an illusion of some moonstones. I'll trade it for a vision of that hypnomatic part. You have learned much, young one. You've learned much. Now bring me more moonstones, and riches shall be your reward. 2,028 volts. All right, well, it's still it's no not, Zodiac, but... but What's this? One million for the Zodiac, right? And one point five for the Rhino. But why would you want to get the Rhino if you have the Zodiac? Was that the reverse? It was one million for the Rhino, and was it? 
Yeah, should I go to the desert, or did you get just get those already? No, the ever all the cr crystals are done. All right, let's uh, let's go in. We already went in here, so Where I think that was the last thing we have to do on this planet for now. This Ooh. one? Yeah, no, we'll go back to the ship. Okay. We gotta go to another planet. We gotta get a third and final hypnomatic part to get the thing running so that we can come back here with the hypnomatic. Oh yeah, that's right. Oh god. Using this is... It, it takes a while before it stops. Yeah. You can't, you can't preemptively stop it. Very soon. I feel like there was a weapon that was like, uh, the Clank Zapper, I want to say. Maybe that wasn't until, uh, 2. I remember it being a very expensive, but not very useful weapon. Uh. Uh, that does appear to be in this game, so that might be the last one. I ha oh, I guess you get it, uh. The last slot. It might be New Game Plus exclusive. Oh. Okay, then. I guess we're going here? Uh, sure. All Gone City. We're gonna have to save the planet from the from the pets, from the chia pets from hell. Clank zapper, clank shopper, uh, shocker. Oh, it levels up. It's just clank, just shooting stuff. Can be purchased upon reaching challenge mode for one million bolts. Wow. No, thank you. It's just like a, a, a radius zap around you. Alright, we're ready to go. I must have never even got that on uh, my completed file. I'm completed. Yeah, it seems like... Shield Charger is good for these guys because there are a lot of them and they are small. Wait, hold on. Uh... Oh, the thugs for less people? Are the Chia Pets gonna- are the pets gonna attack them? Uh, probably. I guess they're here to deal with the, uh, the shield does run out by taking hits, though. Okay. So much for that. How- oh. Oh, I- I have to save all the- Probably. Clank Zapper deals apparently random damage at a seemingly random rate of fire. What? Wait, wait, what? It's random? Random the weapon? Another weakness of the weapon is that it's not obvious when the weapon's ammo has been used up and needs to be reapplied. What? Uh, what? Are, is what this... is the point of this weapon? It's a weapon you use to challenge yourself or something? I guess. Intentionally shitty weapon? The Clank Zapper? That's like, uh... That really works in, like, uh, Trojan games. Like, uh, like, Enter the Gungeon, where you can throw, like, a random weapon in, a D in like, a D-rank chest. And Rain that would be shitty. Range short. Rate of fire low. One million bolts. Why? Okay, what's the leveled up version? Is that better? Uh... This weapon levels up really quickly with the... Clank Shocker emits red laser beams that set enemies on fire. Okay. More useful than the Zapper, but much like the Zapper, becomes redundant when the other weapons are in the game. Okay, why... why bother? What? Why would you ever spend one million bolts on that and not, uh... Not the fu- not, it, not the either... The Rhino, the Zodiac, anything else. It's... It is... Like, if it, they're gonna make a challenge mode exclusive, make it super cheap. If it's gonna be shitty. I feel like... That's like a troll weapon. Well, these guys infinitely spawn, right? Uh, no. There are oh. just a lot... Uh, ex unless there's a spawner. It looks like they may be a spawner up ahead. Okay, well, I'm trying to level up this shield. Then, uh, oh, wow, it came a long ways. Yeah, give me a moment. Oh, they follow me. Cool. Okay, where is it? Uh, no, down over here. Shield. Charger ammo. 500 per? Sure. Oh, whoops. Sorry about that. Oh, 
fuck it. The shield is one of those unfortunate things where you can't get uh, ammo in crates, which I guess is just to, like, force you to go back. Otherwise, I guess you'd just be more or less invincible with enough ammo crates. Yeah, I can see why that would be a problem. Alright, spawners! Get to spawning! Oh, we break crates and shit. Uh, hello? It's up ahead. The spawners are like, you remember the little canisters they pop out of? You can oh. see them. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna do this until oh, yeah. the, until my shield levels up fully. Yeah, it's like a vending machine on the back wall of this area. Okay. I'll, I'll get to it in a sec. They move fast. This upgrades pretty quickly, actually. Probably it's only saving grace. Also, I'm getting cash from just killing them, so really... These come guys on! Are, these guys are probably worth a uh, surprising amount of weapon XP. Because they have low hit points, but uh, they do deal a lot of damage when they hit you. So yeah, the They're shield just cannon enemies. It appears as though none of them want to, like, get out. And they're, they're afraid of you. It, it's ran out. So spawners can run out after a while. I guess, I guess so. Even dead gods bleed. Or even gods bleed. Alright, let's check. This let's is a game that actively discourages grinding. <laughs> it actively discourages grinding for, for weapons for 1 to 1.5 million... Why you gotta discourage grind? I feel like... I mean, it's fine. I like the, the, the... I don't necessarily like grinding. The weapons should just be cheaper. Yeah, either make the weapons cheaper, or not make grinding, don't make grinding necessary to get them. I don't, under I don't understand. You're, you're we want players to feel a sense of reward and accomplishment when they get something new in the game. God, that but unironically, Jesus, or that but honestly. Oh, hello, guys. Hello. Oh, damn it. These guys are hard, don't they? Upper bomber. Yeah. Oh, uh, did it miss? Uh, it's still going. Oh, it again. It tracks? Now, now, now. now. Oh! Before it floats, to, it just floats straight ahead. I forgot! Yeah, I forgot how- I forgot how the weapon worked. Sorry. Yeah, it floats ahead and it keeps floating. Deployable. So we finished Bomberman. Yes. We, uh, we're still doing Pokemon. We're still doing this and Zelda. Uh, yeah. Next things to start will probably be uh, Shadow and Mario Galaxy. Too, yeah. Right. Yeah. One of which is going to be better time than the other. Oh, jeez. These guys just do not want to die with this. They, they take two hits with the shield. Do I want to run back and grab some more? You can hover bomb them. Nah, it's not worth going back now. Alright. Just on. don't die, because if they get two bites in, you're gonna... ...be having a bad day. Oh, they spawn. God. It's an infestation. The galaxy's a threat. Yeah, they're, they're really selling this threat. Well, there goes the shield. Oh, you're one hit away. Alright. Life anywhere around here? Stay back! Oh, you! Yeah. Dangerous teeth. Tiny legs. Yeah, that's a... Remember Furbies? Those yeah. Existed. Is this is this like supposed to be a take on Furbies, you think? Weren't they banned in like uh, government sites because they could remember uh they like recorded shit? Oh, perhaps. Hey. 
I, I think this... that was a gimmick of Furby's. It probably works word. well on them. I mean, you have to be close enough to them. Yeah, that's uh, gonna be a risk there. Yeah, they're small. So they're oh, just... shit! Come here! Is there still another spawner? I get, are they spawn? Don't they spawn each other or something? Oh yeah, they, they multiply, so you gotta deal with them quickly. Rapid breeding cycle. <laughs> They're very ra Why do they need a very rapid breeding cycle? Oh, you know, I should have thought about this before. Yeah. I use those a lot on the, uh, the, the dragons. Probably very effective. Alright, did, did we get them all? Death seems likely. Checkpoint? No, just another. You maybe you should go back. Yeah. Get more shield. If only you could get health. Final oh. health, not a thing in this game. We don't sell that. Not a thing in uh, in another game, in the other game, probably. The number three? Yeah. I don't so, think so. It wasn't a thing in one either. No. You've never Dude. been able to buy health in these games. That's so weird! It's a like, little odd. You think that would be a thing? I think like we could go in our in our ship and out again, but I think that would respawn everything. Yeah. This is some Dark Souls shit. Just <laughs> no, even in Dark Souls you can heal. That does seem like kind of an oversight. You should probably you should be able to get just get health of these things. Yeah. Either buy it or. You know, you, you get health when you leave, right? That's what you said? Like, when you leave a planet, you get health? I, I'm assuming. Is I that their method? And it but responds to everything. I don't they, remember for sure. Did Ratchet and Clank invent the concept of a bonfire? Bonfire? You know, in uh, Dark Souls, when you uh, rest in a bonfire, you regain your health and your uh, uh, Estus Flask charges, but uh, it respawns everything. Oh. You can, uh, you can kind of sneak six shields. I know it's too late to tell you this now. But you can do that by, uh... Oh, you didn't buy any. I uh, Did I really not buy any? Fuck's sake. You can buy one, equip it, and then you'll have a shield out and buy five more. Oh. Because they don't have a time limit. They stay until they take enough damage. Uh, or until they deal enough damage? I think only until they take enough damage. I think useful. they can deal damage forever. It's an initial boost of speed, and then it's just all, only That's slightly... Rift. Yeah. That's, uh... That's not useful. I should just top off everything while I'm here. Might as well. Oh. I got it. Uh, Obviously, we got all the crystals. Obviously, we're not gonna get enough for... What's the Zodiac? Okay, so the Rhino is one million. Yeah. I don't think we're gonna get enough because for the, the Rhino. Because the shields? Rhino... Did you get the shields? Yeah, I got... Oh. Yeah, you're right. There we go. Yeah, it's almost done. It's almost done being leveled up. I knew the proto-pet uh, planet was going to be good for this. Yeah. Good thing we did it. I do, I do know in uh, 3, I don't know about this, but at least the uh, the wall shield you can place is A, very useful, and B, levels up by taking damage. Yeah. Not by dealing it. Which makes sense. Yeah. Like, the third game is the best of the, of the series, I think. In, in terms so of just... YouTube video. Why Ratchet and Clank 3 was such a disappointment. <laughs> Which, did you watch it? I, I didn't watch it. That guy has to be in the minority, right? Are there a lot of people who feel that way? Uh, you sh you're not playing. You should look it up. Oh, shit. Hello, Charles. These guys just eat through his shield if you're not Is careful. There, uh, look around for life. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Yeah, they deal a lot of damage. Oh, maybe this guy being here was, uh, was also kind of, uh, I'm dead. You can keep going. I, I can get debate between two and three, but... He must have... What, what about three just made him hate it? I, I wonder. Uh... Maybe not hate it, but... Like, just not like it? Or why, or I, ha, I guess find it to be a disappointment, rather. Because it started going towards the, like... Missions? Other, other shooters? Like, the, there were a lot of areas of, uh, missions, and, uh... 
Less yeah, free like the, the, Sarge, the sergeant missions. Oh yeah, where you're in closed areas with several options. Which this game has too, just in the form of arenas, but... Yeah. I wonder if he disliked the arena sections of the game. Maybe it was just by principle that it was getting more like other shooters. Which then went was even more so in Deadlocked, granted. Yeah. Why? It was such a huge disappointment. Yeah, cool, I got it. Is it Tesla Barrier! It's ranged! Why Ratchet and Clank lost its edge. Lost its edge. Why Ratchet Deadlocked is sick. Is that the, that's not sick? the same guy, is it? <laughs> sick! So... Why Ratchet and Clank 3 was disappointing. Is that the one you saw? Uh, that's the, the thumbnail I saw here. Yeah. I, I'm not gonna watch the video on stream, but I'll click it and, like, check the comments. Why Ratchet Deadlocked is This is a much better sick. weapon than the original Shield Charger. Same guy. Same guy! He was super disappointed in Up Your Arsenal. Loved Deadlock. I want to see what he, why he did. I, now I want to see the video and see why he disliked it. Because that's that's interesting to me. Because you think that if you didn't like uh, 3, you would also not like uh, Deadlock. But the gaming Brit. Not, not uh, hating on him or anything. I'm just saying that that's an interesting opinion. If everybody who's watching this takes this out of context. We're not making fun of the guy. At least I'm not. I don't know how. What. what uh... How did I not notice the lack of any grinding in 3? It, is that a bad thing? I, we're only judging it by its comments, you realize. We're not acting. I know, I know. I haven't watched the video. Stop ruining my childhood with facts. It. It seems like a lot of people are commenting on the story, so I'm guessing he talks about the story a lot in the video. Okay. So he's not saying gameplay-wise it's bad. He said I maybe I don't maybe know. Maybe not. I don't know. We don't know. I'll, I'll watch it later. I'll watch it later and I'll make. I'll do a video reacting to it. How about that? Yeah, this weapon's really good for just clearing out like. Uh, Like the proto pets. Because what was the story in three? It was just uh... robot supremacy. Yeah. Okay. The, the okay. You know what was disappointing about three story? A secret agent clank. Oh yeah, that that sucks. I agree. Yeah, it, that ga gameplay wise is great though. Story wise, it's weak. Gameplay wise, it's really good. And I don't even think the story is weak. It's just that particular aspect of it. The, yeah. the everyone shit on Ratchet. Haha, ha, he's funny. That's except for the people who served under him. He was the sergeant. He got a promotion. You forgot to mention you can play the entire story with multiplayer. Wait, what? You can? Ratchet deadlocks? No, you can't. Can you? Did we do that? Oh, if we can, we should try it. Also, apparently can run out of ammo for this. Sorry, I was looking at web pages, not reading chat. Uh, I, I know Charles' favorite is 2, which... I, I love both 2 and 3. The main thing I love about the Ratchet games is the upgradable weapons, though, so... Uh, just, just for that, 3 is my favorite, having so many stages. And if I could have 3 with the weapon system from Deadlocked, I would. That one gets, like, really lots of levels, lots of upgrades. It just sacrifices a lot of the, like, platforming, which I enjoy in 4. You guys can survive 2 Mega Bomb hits, by the way. That's interesting. God, we gotta clean up the Protopet mess ourselves, just... Kill them all one fucking proto pet at one a time. One by one by one. I am gonna here. I'll, I'll post the links to both videos in yeah. uh, the Discord. I do plan on watching those. So Charles can watch those and not us. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. You can check. You can check them out later. All right. Continue point. All right. Let's get. Uh... I thought Quirk being so revered was odd in uh, number three. Oh yeah, because I mean, to be fair, you get people today who still revere people despite some 
shit coming out about him. So I can kind of I can see it in regards to uh, three, just because the main bad guy is Nefarious, who Quark was the guy who took down Nefarious. Yeah. Come on, multiply already. Oh, you guys are. Oh, here. you're already leveled up with the shield. You're trying yeah. to level up the bombs now. Yeah. Uh, I should have been. I should have been paying attention. I feel like there's a. Uh, uh, there's a. There's a dick platinum bolt somewhere around here. Out this window. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, go out here and freeze this water. Oh, freeze it. Okay. The bottom left. Terminator. I don't think you're hitting it. Oh, I guess technically. Do I have to climb down that? You have to grind the ice. Radical. That's crazy. Hello, Rykon. Thank you for joining us. Hey, thank you for wishing death. I like the levels. Wait, how do I get back? I like the levels in uh, 2 and 3. I like oh, the levels in uh, 1, 2, and 3. I, I'm not super crazy about the... What, what do you call those? Like, the sergeant sections. They felt very... They're, mis they're, they're missions. Like, they're, they are mission. Like, they, felt, they felt Halo-esque, and I'm not a huge fan of those, but I, I don't mind them being in the game. Yeah, I feel like... It was a, it was a little bit of a departure from the platforming. But not so much as Deadlocked. Just rob the ATMs. Oh, yeah, this is a bank, isn't it? Give me all your money! It's okay, I'm a hero. This is a uh, galactic business. Are they dropping poison bombs? Maybe. They're dropping pesticide. The sergeant bits felt uninspired. You mean, like, the, the dialogue or the gameplay, the levels? Oh wow, I think my shield's killing them before my hover bombs can. I, I like the dialogue for it. It was good. Oh, the levels. It eh. was good. It was, uh... Just the concept of, uh... Of, like, Ratchet just being like, Sergeant?! It's the only respect he gets in that game. Yeah. Oh, hey! Hello! Oh, these handsome blokes! That's, uh... That's Dak and Jackster. Which is which? I don't know. Play the game to find out. Coming eventually. Boy. So, at... 000.001. Is it... Is it like yes. for robots? Is that robot speak? I guess. That was 12 digits, which is a byte and a half, divided in a very strange way. <laughs> I wonder if that translates to anything, or if it's just, like... I mean, I know how to try how to translate binary to decimal. But it, it, that would have to be a byte. That would have to be eight, eight digits. Oh, is there another... Another... Yep. Drop your fucking... Oh, you're dropping more down here, too. The, uh, oh, the final armor was also one million. Yeah! There's so many things that you just can't afford in this game. It's things that you'd like, I'd like to afford. Like, they want to make you, oh, you, you have to choose. Like, uh, choose a build of, of Skyrim chain. Just let, us, like, let us have everything. That's the fun part. It's a Ratchet game. Ratchet? Yeah, the thing I like to do in Ratchet game is, like, survival shit. Not have weapons, because I can't afford them. I love being poor in a Ratchet & Clank game. Yeah, I love I love playing a sci-fi game and feeling like I'm just I'm just still in my normal suburban life. Ratchet, survival horror mode. There's still a spawner there. I see it. I don't have any Everbomb ammo. Oh! Stuck by me. I was able to afford everything. That's because you played Clank video game for 60 hours, Charles. Are people wanting to use the... 
Are, is that why we we don't can't afford everything? Is we don't, don't want to play a video game for. I just grind the shit ton, but that's not fun. That if a game is requiring you to grind, it is not a well balanced or developed game. You might want an area weapon, maybe a heavy bouncer or something. Oh yeah. I was doing well. Sheepinator is nice because it doesn't take ammo. Yeah. Oh god, this just wipes him out. Yeah. Okay. It's great on little enemies. It's over there. Crates. Turn an animate object into sheep. Uh, an another one. Cool. Wait, are they... Oh, there's some. So there's somebody up there. Okay. Man, I wish I could see camera. There we go. I got him. They're still not dead though. Make it count. Oh. Two. two uh, there's only one. Shit. That reach. Not, got him. Not accurately. Spray and pray. <laughs> you know what? I have a weapon for this exact situation. Let me just uh, dig it out. Nope, that's not it. Uh, there we go. Fire meteors Only? up at you. It's a really powerful early game. That was like uh, before we got the mega, the rocket tube. Yeah, it was uh, a really good weapon. Well, if I'm out of hover bomb angle, I might as well just bring it to the barrier. Oh, get over here! Wipe out seven, wipe out all 1.2 billion of the, of the Proto-Pet Menace. We got Porcos here. You saw that game, right? Hong Kong 97? Uh, I, I have seen it. Was that part of the dialogue from it? Yeah, wipe out all... It's like a horde of fucking ugly reds have, have, start, have attacked. Wipe out all 1.2 billion... Like meanwhile, communists? Yeah, meanwhile, and there's like a subplot about how they took uh, the guy's... Uh, the one guy's head, right? Hey, even robots eat c cereal. I say they use the same fucking number of sequence. Grinding never gr felt like grinding. Uh, I, I, I think you're in a minority there that enjoys the game quite that much, Charles. I guess you just, like, replayed everything constantly for hours and hours and hours obsessively. I mean, the thing is, is that when I have to go, when I had to go grind something, I would put on a podcast. I, I, I don't do that for games. Like, if I really, really like a game, I'll replay it. But I don't just do the same tasks in the game over and over again. I think at, at one point I did do a uh, regular game and New Game Plus in a row. You get a shield. Now. Oh, yeah. You're dying. Using this before. Oh, blaster. Wait! Oh! It went through my shield! I think uh, when the shield breaks, you take the damage from the attack that broke it. Oh, that's, uh. Oh, that only makes the shield only good if you're, like, at, like, maximum health or, like, higher than. Well, you can't be too incredibly, like, uh. Useful. Rec reckless with it. You still have to try to avoid damage. Alright. 
Can I just take- get a fucking second here? Seriously? Shit, I can't drop. I can't. Oh, there we go. Can you just, like, run through them? This is, like, this isn't a beat-em-up. You can not kill everything in the area and move on, right? Oh, damn, the... They're shooting me. Oh, uh, clear out these robots and then, uh, like, blow up that statue. I think that's a skill point. Okay. Down with Megacorp. Fuck the machine! Oh wow, they make it... They make it hardy. It's a tough statue. Real hardy. Uh, it's flashing red. We need to, uh, like, pulse rifle it? Sorry, it's a heavy lancer now. Oh, wait. Oh, pulse rifle that weapon. Vaporizer? Uh, yeah. All gone city. Contents. Skill points. Okay, you can stop. I'm, I'm gonna check. I'm gonna double check that there's Actually, a... you know what? There's a bomb. Right in the grind ma mail segment. Uh, no. It's not destructible. Why, Why is it flash red? red? I remember that <laughs> I remember that fuck That makes no sense! Why are you- So there are two- two skill points on this planet. One for, uh... One for riding a rail without taking any hits. And one for, like, protecting all the robots in this sequence. Oh, that- that's fucked. Yeah. I remember that fucks with me every time I play this game, because the statue flashes red. And there are so many other things in this game that you destroy for skill points. It's not just... Okay, I got this again. This one, this does it. This takes a while to level up. The upper bomb. Yeah. Yeah. Especially since it's like the last weapon you get in the game, just about when you have, frankly, a lot of better weapons. Yeah, much better weapons. Like it's odd that this is more expensive and has has less ammo than the heavy, the, the bouncer, for example. This bounce is great. Bounce is great. This is not so much. It, maybe they think the use is that you can detonate it anytime you want to. Like, gives you some leeway to miss. That guy was just on his break. Alright, so there's the dudes up top, right? Can we snipe them before we get close? Yeah, oh, I bet they're spawning now. It's hard to tell depth with this thing. Yeah. You can get the ground guys with it, you might just have to, like, snipe them. Oh. oh, that one shot at him. Nope. Oh, it just knocked him off the ledge. Yeah. Got him. Just standing around, not firing anything. Just still didn't aggro the proto pets. At least the explosion radius is nice. Oh, he's Hello. coming to kick you. Oh, well, that guy saw. It's not worth on the proto pets, I don't think, because it's just they're small enemies. Well, I have to clean out this area, though. Shit. Is it? Maybe this. Maybe the upgraded version can run out by zapping enough things. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Cause it. This one seems to be going faster. Yeah. It is good at dealing with It's good with as an offensive though. weapon, but not, uh, not, not, uh, not so good in defense. 
Hello. Oh, there's a target. Hard target. Heavy objects. Heavy objects. <laughs> why, why are you getting close? Stop, stop. You should fire at them before you aggro them, is what I was suggesting. Sorry, I, uh... Yeah, this thing's leveling up really slowly. Yeah. Maybe in arenas, it would work, it would go better. Yeah. What arena? Is, is there one arena left, or...? The only thing that's left is the impossible challenge, is the only one we haven't done, I think. Oh, is that...? Oh, yeah. Which is quite difficult. Do I need to walk down, up and down these fucking... Yeah, I think yeah. there's at least one more guy we need to kill. I don't know if it needs us to kill all the proto-pets or not. Charles wants you to use the Walloper. The Walloper? Would that actually work? I'm sure it would work fine. We just, we don't use the one weapons because we haven't needed to level them up. But. Yeah, but we can't, uh, we're out of ammo for the one, so might as well. I wonder if those get kind of left behind now that, uh, like, we've upgraded all the others. Especially, why did they include the bomb glove of all weapons they could bring back? Because, uh, I don't know, you think the, the nuke launcher, the mini nuke is too powerful? I can't touch it with the glove because the fucking Tesla shield is just... It complements the shield, says Charles. Also, did he just fucking no-sell the fucking boot to the nuts? I guess so. Rocks are blocking me. Yep, rock blocked. The fact that right, they can just fucking... Again. Rapid breeding! It's a feature. It's a feature. Feature of this creature, a creature feature. Gotta pose a question: How do you kill orders? There we go. We're gonna have to freeze out, aren't we? Oh, yeah. Oh look, elf. Oh, a checkpoint. That's I not died. a belt. That's not an enemy. You're getting sleepy. Very sleepy. What the f uh, uh, you are getting very sleepy. Ahem. Ah, a customer. You, sir, look like someone who could use a hypnomatic. Oh, okay. This, this charming character this never returns. We'll make it for free. Ah, uh, for a fee. A very small fee. <laughs> we don't have it, though. This is Mr. Hat. Turned out it was his second personality all along. <laughs> oh, we needed to take like a different. Uh, we need to take like a different route to get the last hypnomatic part, didn't we? Oh well, we gotta. Let's get inside. I think we have a shortcut back here for uh, next time. I think we've unlocked that. Yeah, with this car. The ship car. The Tesla gun is fun too. the hell? Portals? Sure. We ride our rails to portals at, at the terminus. This is, this is. We're at terminus. I'll the rail part. Unless, oh. You want to? Uh, you want to? Can you do it without taking a hit? I, I'm not confident. I used one to try to, because I, re I remember they deal a lot of damage. Oh yeah, they're very powerful. That was, that was when we were using the statue, or we were trying to break the statue. Hello, Liberation. That, that is some... That is sad. That is some sad fucking commentary. The, uh, what, the statue being indestructible? Yeah. That, uh, you the cannot take down Megacorp. <laughs> it's like, I, that just makes me want to try harder. What, why bother putting a statue that can take damage? To troll people who have been attacking statues. Go 
Get fucked, proto pets. Just attacking proto pets while grinding on a rail. You don't fuck with Karibo jeans. They are just little, like, little evil blue Karibos. Yeah. Whereas Karibos were, like, good, good proto pets. That's what they wanted to domestic. They wanted to make domesticated Karibos, yeah. and and who wouldn't? They yeah, yeah, they fucked up. We we're talking uh, before the stream about what uh, what an unsympathetic asshole Kaiba is. Yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh, Yu-Gi-Oh, Kaiba is a Kaiba just for being a, he's not an anti-hero, not a villain, and yet like Vegeta in Dragon Ball has killed people, relapsed and killed people again. I would feel more sympathy for him as a character than Kaiba. Yeah. <laughs> Kaiba's just a dick. Well, the thing is that if Vegeta bellows out and becomes a good father, and, uh... And Kaiba... He's he's only good to his brother, and that's it. Yeah. His rivalry with Yugi is kind of bitter. It's like, I have to beat you. Ah! Oh! I couldn't see, level. Well, that's fine. It's You start from the very beginning. It, like, counts as a new try, yeah. right? Walloper on rails is something. Can you use the walloper on rails? You can, can you? Why? You can use anything on rails? You can use the walloper? Yeah, you rock! <laughs> Real rocket! <laughs> is he crying I mean, while holding a rocket launcher? What the fuck? Like, imagine if Tony Arl Hawk music. Imagine if Terminator, right? He had his minigun, he was firing his minigun, but he was also doing a sick grind on a skateboard. Tony Hawk likes guest characters, and Terminators appear on everything. Put him in, uh, Tony Hawk 6, featuring the Terminator. <laughs> Hasta la vista, kickflip. Yeah, that is a fucking special grind. He's just grinding, uh, something while, like, firing a minigun everywhere. I cannot seem to use the walloper on the rails. I'm pressing, I was pressing circle and nothing was happening. Not that I need to use anything, this shield alone is dealing with all of the proto-pets. suck when my shield runs out between one of these two proto pets. They're preparing for it. Early! Fuck! Oh, better kill yourself. I think we can survive without the skill points. Yeah. Unfortunately enough. So radical. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what could that be a reference to? It's Crash Bandicoot. Why is the hypomat hypnomatic guy like the hypo? It's hip like it's a hippo diplomat. It's in Zootopia. <laughs> Hiplomatic sounds like the name of a really weird '90s hip hop album. Why haven't you been using the Killanoid shield combo? Because Killanoids are expensive. And we have to level up the fucking- I guess shields are also expensive. Are they the same price? They're 100 each. But, well, why oh, has it's, more it value? summons four Killanoids at once. Yeah. This motherfucker's got a Bowser shell on. What the fuck? How much did it cost? Ten thousand. Oh, that's not bad. Do not even think about it. To use the hypnomatic, target a receiver bot and press circle to take control of the robot. You're so cheap. I'm I'm sorry for maintaining any hope that we might be able to buy something in this uh this game yet. Oh, I need to equip it. Yeah, what, what, something we won't be using anytime soon. Uh 
We haven't really been using a ton of either the, the tractor beam or the dynamo. Uh, let's say get rid of the dynamo. I am robot. You, you only have 30 seconds. Welcome to drone warfare. This is truly the future. Automatic rockets. The tough little guys. Oh, was that all that was for? To get the taxi? But oh, we had but the taxi. Oh, I guess we switched to the taxi's target. Oh, this is backwards. Yeah, so go to get on the taxi. No. Oh, wait, that's to return to the ship. Wait, what was, what was the, the point what, of that? What was the point of that? Is there a bolt in there? So we could return to the ship if we couldn't afford it, but if we can't afford it, then we can't return to the ship until we use it. Yes. You want to be giant plank? How's this gonna work? Is it? Remember how Clank was? Remember how Ratchet was an asshole to Clank for most of the previous game? Yeah. And then when they then when they got over their different when he killed Quark, he got over it. He just needed some good old revenge. And then he got zapped by lightning. He's like, oh, little buddy, you can't fit out there. I'm like, motherfucker, you hated me. Why? Where, where's this little buddy shit coming from? You are an asshole. I'm getting an apartment in the city, and you can't come and play my video games. It's to the left of the armor, yeah. of the weapons thing. Uh, oh, here? No. Here. Oh yeah, because we need the fucking... Why is this here? I don't know. Let's go giant, Plank. Let me make sure I get... Isn't it great finding ammo crates immediately after you max out your ammo? Yeah. That is a nice addition to three, is the all, all ammo button. Wait, well, where are we going? Uh, sure. To the satellite. He really, he f even flies like the Iron Giant. Yeah. Destroy the mothership. Wait, what's the mo- what? Why are we destroying a mothership? I thought we were fighting proto-pets! <laughs> Landing on things as giant plank is the best. Yeah, it is amazing. Do, do, you know what? Do, does, do, 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 does three have any of this? I think I remember there is a. You remember there's a, a like a movie set section where oh, plank is like uh, stomping around a created a created city. Yeah. So I think there is, there are at least a few giant plank sections in in three. Yeah, that's right. This is have limited ammo. Somehow. Mothership, where are ya? We have the arrow up. Oh, there it is. Get over here. Oh, you can land on some of them. I guess the, the, the ring. How do I dash? You can't. I think uh, circle fires missiles and triangle throws bombs. I'm over here. Oh, it's landing? are fun and ask no questions. I had a friend who had uh, Godzilla destroy all monsters on the GameCube. Or maybe that maybe that was my brother. I, I never I never played much of it. This guy does not want to slow down. We did multiplayer sometimes though. So. Who are they? They were doing a rampage movie, weren't they? With Vin Diesel? Yeah, oh no, The Rock. The Rock. Is. So it lands to plant some more of those. Yeah, so that's, uh... The resources are finite. Buildings don't respawn, by the way. Try to get there. 
I should throw a bomb when he's down. show up if we did a Spelunky Death Roulette. What's Death Roulette? Uh, it, uh, lets people gamble not real money on, uh, how the streamer's going to die. Oh, that, I like that! That's... So even if it were just the two of us, I guess, uh, one person could be the player and the other one is, uh, betting. Yeah, place your bets! Shotgun. You don't lose any speed from firing missiles, so it's worth just holding it down as you approach. But punching those guys. It's nearby. start approaching you with the missiles, and it'll land uh, land more guys. Oh, he, I was, I was off by a bit. He's landing. if I hit him with it. Yeah. Come on, get over here. You motherfucker. Alright, I guess he's uh, not gonna... I've met half demons stronger than you. Uh oh. Uh-oh, what is this? I can't move! I'll just land on him. Looks like Nathan Explosion in Moroni Kenshin. Yeah! Chris <laughs> Freeman just... doing his best uh, caveman samurai voice. Can I use the truck? No. I guess this is just the fight now. Just jumping on it. I'll just, uh, I won't. Is it, is it wanting us to, like, throw bombs from a distance? I don't know. Whatever. But this is I'm gonna out damage him at this rate, so fuck it. There we go. I just jump it on it. Tactics, stomp until it dies. Cool! I did a thing. Why did we do that? That's not a hypnomatic part. What is that? <laughs> do we pull grabber or something? <laughs> no, we already had that. <laughs> Why did we do that? What was the fucking point of that? Alright, what we get? The, the mapper. mapper. Oh. Bit late for that game! Well, I guess back to, uh, back to Tundra Planet so we can save Angela from her pressing invasion after how long has all- have all these detours taken? Sorry, we needed to grab a Hypnomatic! We couldn't we get past your security! Three parts of the Hypnomatic. We had to get a bunch of crystals in the- in the Tundra. Oh yeah, that's right, I didn't use any. 
We probably did not have to detour to the aliens, but who can resist? The, I mean, they're, they were they there just squatting just after the proto pets killed everybody? They were like, oh man, real estate's gonna be real cheap in a moment. Maybe they were planning an invasion, then they saw the proto pets and they just didn't want to fuck with them. We'll, we'll wait for him to die out. Oh, this guy's dealing with them. Perfect. So they re reproduce asexually, right? Does that mean that they can can they'll be fine after they cannibalize each other? Could be. Can they just live off the off themselves for like ever? I, I think it, I think a trait was that they like barely had to eat as well. Oh. The, the setting aside that they're killing machines, they're apparently like super amazing achievements in genetic engineering. Yeah, except for the whole uh, hostile as fuck. Yeah. Thing. Maybe they're just always in pain. I am in pain. Please help me. Well, some people wouldn't like them because they they want it. Some people like feeding their pets. Yeah. So, I can see that backfiring for that. Wait. Oh, we can buy armor. We could buy the armor if we wanted but to. But the the good armor. I mean, there's nothing uh, left to buy, right? Two fifty. We're not gonna get any of the million items, so we might as well. Where? Where's the armor? The door. To the left. That the, one. That one. Yeah, we need we need to look good when we save uh, Angela. What a common name. So this is. We're uh, not gonna get the cool helmet, but we can at least get some cool armor. False. So it's a uh, uh, sixty-six. 66. Yeah. Good old Satan armor. So which which way are we going? Check the map. Trade Moonstone. We already did that. We got all the Moonstones. Did, did we? Did we really? Okay, so there's the... We want to go to the right of the ship, it looks like. Yeah. So we can tank hits now, again. Kind of. We now take one-third of the damage. Sweet. I'm fine with that. That looks crossable. Uh, you're not supposed to, but I'm sure with some kind of glitch or something, you can get across that. This receiver bot has a blaster attack. Press. Uh, actually, give me a moment. I want to try this out. Uh, I want to. I want to see if I can make it. Probably not with a long jump. Not with a long jump. Maybe double jump. Maybe a high jump. We don't have the. If only we had the air blast technique from the last game. Oh, is that why they got rid of it? I no. think you would need some kind of glitch or something. Yeah. We need bomb jumping. Alright, well, I guess I'm gonna have to hypnotize him. Uh, now I think triangle to move to another guy? No? That blows yourself up. No. I guess we should have read the instructions. Square? Circle. Necessary would that be? Very. Good thing. I'm glad they didn't decide to do that. Wait, what? Oh, but I was. Are you? Does a triangle blow you up? Yeah, I hit the wrong button. Yeah. Again. Why did they immediately target me? Oh, he's glowing red. He's been possessed by the enemy. Oh good, they don't spawn indefinitely, there are just a lot of them. Cool, I did it. So Angel's just been chilling out in this factory. Oh wow! That's some good armor. Like, ro like, rocket machine guns don't really affect me. Guns don't affect me. Bullets don't affect me. Oh no, he killed 
the Russian. Excuse me, but I would like to continue playing more of your fine game. It's like, there it is. What the fuck? Oh, that's odd. right there. Bean. Yeah. I'm zero zero ten plus, and this is zero zero ten minus. Hey, it can't be enough that the guy is weak to water. He's got to also have a twin, and his weakness is actually just two of the two of them touching together. Yeah. Turn to the surface. Yes. On the butthole elevator. Okay. Well, there's the ship, but we can't get there from here. Oh, can we ever bomb them? Yeah. How rapid is your respawning? Not rapid- oh, there they go. They just don't notice you if you're not on the snow. Yeah, they- they're- Weakness is that they're actually blind, I guess. Okay, here. Aggro them! Respawn! Off the snow. Where'd he go? It's a mystery! Alright, then I get the cash. Spawn. Come on. 
Come on, here we go. It's like watching Piccolo spit up an egg. I can't see him! Alright, you wanna respawn? Oh, it's not low enough? Okay. Alright, in that case, which one of you wants to die? You can smash you. You're, you're really gonna stand here and grind? Come on! I guess, I guess they have a limit to their respawning capabilities. I guess so. When they said they were incredibly fast breeders, they only meant, like, only a few of them. And, well, and, then, they were and just then they hit menopause, like, instantly. They were just born, Jack. They need at least a minute. Oh. Hello. There's a ship here. Is that... you think that could've... I think that's the same as the, uh... Hey. Nice digs. Yeah. It's a little remnant from oh, my God, she's tall! Life. You? were reincarnated? No, no. You were reincarnated. days. They've got a very generous bonus package. Uh, right. So now that you've got your ID badge, how do we take out the proto pet? Watch this. They gave it. They gave me a house, but it's Mommy, on this godforsaken planet. Where does the proto pet come from? Why, they come from Megacorp, dear. That's right, Mrs. Robot. Oh God, the All stock of the proto pets music. in the galaxy come from right here. In our factory, your little friend is lovingly extracted from the original protopet. Each protopet is given a name and birth certificate that is unique. Our training system helps mold your pet into a wonderful friend that you'll cherish forever. So the next time your child asks, Mommy, where did protopet come from? You can answer with confidence. They come from Megacore. That doesn't explain how to take him out. Is using the original protobet to produce all the others. Exactly. What a wretched existence those, thi existence those things leave. Yeah. Wait, wait, what? 20% off a complete service at Groovy Lube. Oops. <laughs> Wrong one. Groovy Lube. Get it? Because it's like lube. I'll meet you there. What? Sure you want to split I, up? Cause... No, Megacorp's orbital defenses are nasty. With two ships, there's a good chance at least one of us will get through. Good thinking. Just be careful. Right. Can I come in? No? She'll be gone by the time we leave, too. Well, anyway, let's get inside this ship. So I think this is for, like, mining raritanium, which you could do in the desert. Yeah. Which, it's way faster to do it in space. So... Wait, hold on. Can I shoot? I don't think so. But well, you're protected from them, so I guess you can just... You dealt damage by spinning a little bit. Probably not an effective combat strategy. Oh, you can ram them. Yeah. I'm gonna ram them! You know what, I'm just gonna head back to, uh... Let's go home. I must get to the shuttle. Go the p dead center of the galaxy. The final planet. Of course, Megacorp is the, the galaxy revolves around Megacorp. Yeah, they own the galaxy. The planet Eedle. 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 Shoot, we are very close to finishing. Yeah. We got our armor. We it will re reduce uh, two thirds of the damage. That'll come in handy for what I presume will be a very brutal firefight. Wait, we got through the orbital defenses really quickly. There were no orbital defenses. Oh, I love that that's the, the opening is just... You're the looking at that... factory looming over you. That's great. That's a great way to introduce a final area. That's what they did in uh, in Mirror's Edge 2. Yeah. Like, it was just her just looking up at, at the place called the Shard. And just like, okay, I guess I'm gonna climb this now. Yeah. 
Let's fuck their shit up. Ratchet. Ratchet versus Gray Fox. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he did. He did unnecessarily destroy a bunch of shit, didn't he? Can't wait until we like play if we play more Metal Gear Solid. That's gonna be a good time. Yeah. Oh, it's, it's, I, I discovered this. Yeah. Apparently, you know who was? Uh, you remember the the first Yu Hawk Show movie, the thirty minute one, with uh, Yasha and the little kid and everything. Yeah. Apparently, the, in the dub of that, the Karama was voiced by David Hayter. David Hayter voiced Karama. That was that was David Hayter. <laughs> that, I did not know that. David. <laughs> now I'm disappointed you didn't get into anime voice acting more. <gasps> so who voiced, uh, backwards. who voiced Britanni and, uh, Hiei again? Did you? I, you thought that was the Hiei in the second movie sounded that way, right? I know, it was the first movie that sounded Britannian. Oh, was it? Yeah, Britanni and Hiei. You, you, Hakusho, Golden oh, Seal. Understand. In-depth movie review. Oh. Oh, I need to use the hypnomatic. This receiver bot can hypnotize other robots. I could do that before. Robot. Hey, then press circle. Oh, that's right. It was uh. It was redubbed with the Funimation cast, like, way later. Oh, or was it? I think I have that on DVD. The two, in, like, 2011, they released a Funimation dub. Well... But the original was, uh, Media Blasters. Okay, what's the Media... Who are who's in the Media Blasters? I'm uh, looking for that. God, the prisons have their actual security. He is just the right amount of edgy. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Uh. Now it says Kirk Thornton, which I've heard that name before. I think I think that's the right one. Let me. I check. heard of him. We've seen him in other stuff recently. Oh, he's, uh, Jet- he's 002. Oh, is he? That's, uh, that's- that's the big-haired one, right? That's, uh, Gene and Saito. And yeah, that's the big-haired guy, the American. Oh, S Saito from, uh, Ghost of the Shell. Or, uh, no? Rurouni Kenshin? Kenshin, yeah. Uh, yeah! <laughs> that... What's with him voicing arrogant characters? Gene was, uh, the samurai, right? From Champloo. Uh, Yu Yu Hakusho the movie. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he was, he was Okay, right. yeah, that was it. So, yeah, Britannian Hiei was, uh, was Saito. No wonder I thought he sounded Britannian. He voices, like, uh, stuck-up characters. He was Guile in Street Fighter 2, the animated movie. He used a bunch of pseudonyms for his older stuff. Uh, I'm sorry, he was in Ninja Scroll, credited as Spanky Roberts. <laughs> I think... I think... <laughs> that's, uh, that's, that's a, a hentai quality pseudonym. Well, that's like... That's not quite as good as William Hellfire, but Spanky Roberts. What's that name the directors use in Hollywood if they don't want to put their name on something? Adam Smithy? That was it. Okay, I'm lost. Oh, there we go. Wait, I had to climb up here this entire time? Yes. Fucking hell. And tanks. Uh, hey! 
Another shortcoming of this game is that it's the only final hit that counts. So, uh, yeah. That's a little bit of a flaw, especially, see, that was all worth nothing now. Yeah. When it comes to leveling up weapons, unfortunately. Oh, wow. That's, uh... Yeah, that's right, I can charge up to, like, four of them. The weapons aspects of the games just continue to get better from uh, Ratchet Title to Ratchet Title, whereas the... For the most part, the platforming diminishes. Is the trend of it. It's like the Zilla launcher, or the Ari launcher, from, like, uh... How are you gonna beat this tank, Ratchet? Shotgun! Jack's favorite weapon. A good shotgun in games is, like, important. Did I ever tell you, like, so, one of my favorite YouTubers, like, your, what are you, your favorite YouTubers are, like, uh, Pika Spray and, like, uh, uh, Strider X7, right? And those are two of the ones that I watch occasionally, yeah. yeah. Uh, so one of mine is CV11, and he, when he was, like, talking about Doom 2, he, like, got to the shot, the super shotgun, right? Yeah. And he, it was slow motion of its use in, uh, in Doom 2 as, like, a, as, like, a, as, like, a heavenly chorus was, like, playing. It was, it was, uh, amusing just to see, like, why, right. why is it called, why is it, why don't you just call it something else besides super shotgun? Because it's better. Because it's super. Bottom right. Yeah, sorry, I was. Sorry, I. Oh, you have like refresh droids. I think you just killed one. Oh, really? I have to use. I have to hop from droid to droid? That's. You know what, though? Oh, does it respawn everything if I fail? It seems to. Oh, that's dumb. Oh, shoot. Well, this would be harder if you didn't know how to strafe. Yeah, you could uh, very easily accidentally destroy your, uh, your extra droids. You gotta be at a specific distance away. At least these bullets travel all the way to the wall. Yeah. Unlike the blaster. Give yourself more time to do that. Uh oh. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> okay. Fine, ten seconds then. as normal fucking because that's not as fun and engaging jack but fun is in the eye of the you don't want to be able to choose from all the weapons you've gotten over the course of the game you want to play as droid no you want seamus no actually we want cm punk no you want seamus oh they respawn indefinitely the uh the hypno droids oh that's good. That's better than, uh, than what they were asking me to do. 
don't uh, think we can cross there. Some like a door must have opened or something. Yes, so. it. Sure. Right. That was the door key. <laughs> knock, knock, motherfuckers! Oh, wait, hold on. Uh, that, and that, and uh, one you know, day that all ammo button will be ours. Yes. Alright. Okay, there we go. Now, knock knock, motherfuckers! Oh, that's an instant kill. It's not weak, it's just slow. Yeah. And the limited ammo is what really hurts it as well. I would you, like for more than eight. You run out very quickly, and it, uh, it's the same problem as the, as the Seeker. It's just the limited ammo is what makes it such a pain to level up. Yeah. Oh, wow. The explosion didn't go off for that one. Why am I? There we go. Oh, I, I totally missed that one. There, there we go. Just one man army ratchet. Oh, more of you. Cool. This is like some combine shit, this, uh, these weaponry. Yeah? From, uh, Halo? Uh, no. Uh, that was, uh... That's Covenant. No, Combine, they're the Half-Life guys. Ah. What do we do? Uh, send more guys at him. They'll use it up. Oh, it one-shots them now. Yeah. It's very good weapon. It's very good when it's leveled up. I remember it just hit being a pain, though. It was a pain to level up. I got a chunk of it done. Oh, we chose wrong! <laughs> hey, we gotta use all the weapons now. All the gadgets now. It's the final thing. Why'd you give me... Okay, good. I wasn't sure if I was gonna hit that or not. Hello! You have to jump. Wow, the rocket launcher's doing shit! Yeah, it gets... outscaled. Like, it doesn't scale as well as the other weapons. It's like firing a fucking bottle rocket! Shields up! Imagine Ratchet as like a Hanna-Barbera car the character with all these like fucking gu like crazy ass guns and gadgets. He'd be like a, he's just an alien secret squirrel. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, fuck it. Their their strategy was to just throw stuff at the wall and see what stuck. It totally could have happened. Yeah. For all we know, there was an, a little alien gadget using Hanna Barbera character. Maybe several. <laughs> yeah, this one is uh, this one's a talking shark, and he goes solves mysteries with a bunch of kids. This one's oh, a yeah. talking car and it solves mysteries with a bunch of kids. Hey, you know what? People like mysteries to solve with talking mascots. <laughs> I don't remember some of the others. Those, those were like the notable. Semi-successful Scooby-Doo knockoffs. Har Harvey Birdman. I, I mean, of the the blatant Scooby-Doo knockoffs. I know. 
I think, uh, I think the sputtering car got its own episode of Harvey Birdman. I don't remember if Jabberjaw did. I think, I think they were in the same episode. I think one was trying to sue the other one. Jabberjaw and the, and the car? Oh, wait! No, because, uh, no, it was, like, two big groups of, like, idol characters. I think I remember that as well. I don't remember what show that was. That was Harvey Birdman. I, I know, but I don't remember what the idol oh. characters were from. I what Hanna-Barbera show that was. How many fucking... Was Josie and the Pussycats Hanna-Barbera? I don't... Maybe. Was it... I thought that was an actual... Oh, um, whatever. Wasn't there like... Who was what? Casper? Was that Hanna-Barbera? I don't think so. Casper... Mattress. No, not that Casper. If we ain't gonna do Mattress, I'm probably gonna get Casper. I've heard really good things about him. Uh, Famous Studios. Famous? Creation. They're so famous, why haven't I heard of them? Sold the rights to the book to the Paramount Pictures Famous Studios Animation Division. So it's a division of Paramount. Oh, so Paramount owns it. Yeah. Casper meets Wendy. Oh, uh, Wendy. W w Wendy the, good, the, the good little witch. No. No. No, I do not remember that. Oh yeah, that's I right. I think it was the second Casper movie. I don't need to. And I seem to. I, I feel like I remember it airing on Nickelodeon a lot. Ah! Oh, they can hit you while you're hacking. Rocket sucks hard! You could get the, uh... I mean, it doesn't have the, the auto-aim, but you get the sniper out. Vaporize me, Captain! Oh, I got the other guy, okay. I wish more gadgets were like that. You just walk up to the, the one place to use the gadget and press triangle. I think they get better at that over the course of the games. You having fun yet? There you go, got it. <laughs> took me, it took me two tries. Literally. The best puzzles are based on guessing. Wait. Wait, 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 what if... Well, unfortunately, I can't seem to harm them. They just instantly die. They can't handle water. We found their weakness! It's not like they're still there, though. Oh god, it's haunted now! Can you go under? Is there stuff under there? I see if they reappear. They don't. No, oh it's just god. haunted by proto-pets. And you're, you're walking on it? It's... Ah! Uh, oh, it's just shallow. Yeah, it's shallow. But you can't see the floor. Is it shallow or is this a glitch? I don't, I don't know. Well, that's weird. Man, they... Murphy's Law. <laughs> I broke the game. How am I supposed to get up there? I guess, I guess you jump? I have a feeling I did something that I shouldn't have. I think you could double jump if it's tight from up here. Okay, you made it. Damn, Proto 
pits are everywhere. We must destroy Mr. Fizzwidget. I am sick and tired of these god dang proto pets. These motherfucking pets in this motherfucking factory. Oh. You gotta have a budget if you're hiring tanks for indoor combat. Massive. This <laughs> is to guard the factory, clearly. Oh, I missed. These tanks are tough. There we go, got it. Yu Yu Hakusho Wiki lists Hiei's voice actors, but not Kurama's. Oh, what, really? No, no one cares about Kurama. Because he, Hiei's the best character, I guess. Kurama is called Dennis Tagalog in the Filipino dub. Wait, what? Dennis Tagalog? Why? That, that means... That's not even a... Is Dennis a Filipino name? <laughs> what do they call everybody else, then? I don't know. Yeah, Karama. Is it because he's like named something filthy in the. Uh, oh, in there's an Animax Asia dub oh. of Yu Yu Hakusho. Of course there is. Uh -huh. Uh. Okay, now what? Uh, grind. We, we need to get up there. It, unless, did you just come down from there? No, I just got here. Is Wait, there jump a over there? Target or something? No, there isn't. Well, don't jump into the abyss, no. Do I jump over there? On top You're not of jumping thing? from here. No. I'm, I'm not. Look up. Oh, wait, oh, oh there, there it is. is. There, there we is. go. Out of the way. Ratchet enters his zen. Ratchet, are you almost done? Shut up, Clank! Fuck, I missed that one down there. I think this is the most it has. Fuck! <sighs> Shit. Oh, okay, here we go. There we go. <laughs> Electrolyzed. It's what plants crave. Alright, now what? Does this move now? Hey! Fuck that rail. Rails are dumb. We don't need no stinking rails. Okay. level this thing up in the very final room of the game. Yeah. Just in time. Oh, there's so Oh yeah! Go to Papa! Oh no! Oh, there's one more guy. Will one it's more not, be enough? It's not gonna be enough. Guarantee you. Oh. I don't think you want to go back. Well, There's a vendor that, oh, literally right. over here. Oh, but the platform's slow. There, I just saved a, sec a second off the time. Still can't buy health. Less of a problem with this armor, but... So besides 
this guy. Who who would you get to uh who would you get to compose a Ratchet and Clank soundtrack? Because this is just kinda just kinda Hollywood, you know, movie I style get... music. I get Square Pusher. Yeah. He does like a lot a of that beat tune kind of thing. That beat break style that uh like uh, what 90s considered sci-fi music to be just the uh, hey a, a drum and bass here we go get the bomber man guy honestly that that'd be a little bit too happy for the tone of this game though yeah you want dark square pusher does that what uh, is uh, who else uh what the check the weapons pages see what oh hell oh yeah that was one ammo that was one the weapon, the weapon gets really good. Pause and go to the like the weapon, the special or options or something to re to, re to read what our new ones do now that we have them all. Okay. It's uh, a special or hell. Giant ballistic bomb, upgraded weapon, does, so more damage. Nothing special about the new bouncer. Yeah. Higher Fires up to four. Oh, you can charge it up. Yeah, I, I was doing that. Once. I was doing that earlier. I'm like, oh, you can charge it. I forgot about this. Did it use four uh, missiles at once that way? Yeah. Oh. Plasma storm. Yeah, just stronger. Upgraded weapon sends five things. That's a big upgrade. Like, it's, it's not a great weapon by itself, then it suddenly becomes amazing. Yeah. So That's going to be really useful for the boss. Yeah. Uh, this is launched just with a special turret, press uh, square to fire his machine gun, hold X and release bombs. Oh, you can do that. I guess so. And then, Turn. exploding sheep. Rip rhino aspirations. Yeah. At least we got to see it. Auto-targeting missiles. Yep. This rifle can be used... It's explosive bullets. Oh, that's right. It explodes on contact after upgrading. Yeah. Fire three seekers. <laughs> we just stopped using the, the, the shredder, the ninja stars. Yeah. Well we had to upgrade all the other stuff, so Oh, go back. Left is a target. See that? Oh, is that a tractor beam? Oh I got rid of the track. You can just equip it manually, you don't need to put it in the circle. Yeah. I heard but I Oh wow, somebody's uh, found me. Sorry, I'm busy. I got rails to grind. Shit! Double shit! It's okay, the platform saved us. Won't, uh, won't for the next time. Oh, I guess I'm gonna have to kill you. And then I pull out my gun! And then the midget wakes up in the bed. <laughs> then, the midget, then the midget begins to wake up. We, uh, we, I don't think we told the on stream about how we discovered R. Kelly's full In the Closet song. Yeah, we were, I thought it was a parody for the longest time, but no, R. Kelly, that's an actual song. I, I didn't, well, I showed you the, the Trapped in the drive through music video, which yeah. I liked. I didn't realize it was a parody of something, yeah. or that that South Park episode was referencing it. I had no idea this R. Kelly song existed. Until, until you mentioned it, and we listened to some of it. Yeah. And it turned out to be like a several hours long hip hop. Yeah, at run. least an hour and a half. Or at least or an it was hour. two hours altogether, because yeah. there were like 40 parts of it or something. Yeah, it just tracked the Released over several years. Yeah. And we listened to the first part, and then we skipped ahead to like part 11. Yeah. Then the mission begins to wake up. That's the first I, line. Yeah, and I, and I just, just could died. Not, I just could not stop laughing at that because it's just so. Of all the places to re-enter this story. Yeah, a midget. What the fuck? And I, I, I assumed that was like, oh, you just skipped the last part. No, it, it's eleven of like forty. Yeah. Oh, the blaster's kind of obsolete now too. Yeah, the, the heavy lancer is not so heavy. Now can we grind our rails in peace? Yeah, I unlocked everything. Now it's just uh, rotating them out when we start running out of ammo, ammo for stuff. Oh, 
the shield doesn't block it. Nope. Fortunately, it's non-lethal. It's just minimal damage. Oh, we got a platinum bolt. What are the platinum bolts? Those get mods. Can we check the check the skill points menu or options or special maybe? Uh, I think cheats is what we get for skill points, right? Yeah, we oh, we got a tux. Yeah, let's do the tux. Yeah, final boss in style. Did we already do this one? Did we? I don't know. Maybe. I, don't, I think if we, I think maybe I am. I think I unlocked Tux Ratchet by clearing out all the crystals. Like that's what got us enough skill points, and I forgot. Okay. Well, in that this case. This is it. The prototype duplication room. I'm sorry, I'm late. I had some trouble with the guards. <laughs> Ratchet, what the fuck are you wearing? Just in time. Okay. Let's see if this thing works. What? She is trying to tell us something. She wasn't built with a speech input output. Bye now. Enjoy the hygienator. <laughs> Remember, you bought it from Steve. The hygienator. <laughs> Steve McCork. <laughs> now that I've sold my one millionth hygienator, why was this I can recorded? That's the comeback of the greatest this superhero who ever lived. Captain Quark. She reappears. So I can rescue them from a new disaster. <laughs> it's okay. It's like anti-hero to. Well, I guess he was a villain in the last game. That main villain. Yeah. <laughs> His girlfriend. Mister Fizz Widget. <laughs> it was Cork all along. This is bad. All right, just what? Is going on? <laughs> Allow me to explain. I'm about to save the galaxy from the protopets, and you are about to become public enemy number one. Oh, and two and three. Guards, seize them! Why are you listening? Wait, wait! I guess they're robots. Smile, it's showtime! How did that work? Get them! Shit. Citizens of Bogon, I am Captain Quark. I come to you in this, your darkest of hours, to shine the flashlight of justice on your galaxy. <laughs> flashlight of justice? <laughs> As you know, a living menace called... Can you imagine if a celebrity washed up in America in and then galaxy. just decided to go somewhere what else and try again? <laughs> Tommy Wiseau Quark goes to Japan to try to make a Japanese movie and make it big. Yes, the citizens. Yeah. These are the masterminds behind Megacorp's experiment with death. He's a villain in the and first now, two games. With this, uh, super electro gadget I invented, I will end the protopath threat once and for all. That's my elixir more. I invented it. Ahem. Stay tuned, dear viewers, as I amplify this the cameraman has no this loyalty. Helix, so yeah. thingy and render every protopet in the galaxy completely harmless. Allow me to demonstrate. <laughs> Fucking idiot. Karibo, no! Wasn't there a giant <laughs> evil looking Karibo? Did they all fused into at one point? Didn't that happen? <laughs> like the five yeah. Karibo brothers. Yeah, that was, in, that was in the evil Yugi duel. Oh, he's been corrupted by the magic of, of Atlantis. And thus the universe was doomed. <laughs> Damn it! I thought there was a walkway! Ratchet tripped. Oh, save you! Oh, he's gonna he's got like a shield at first. Uh, can we deal damage, or is it gotta wait for that to run out, I wonder? I think we need to wait for that to run out. Okay. There he goes. Full homing rockets! You missed uh, all of them. Oh. I see. And shields up. Oh, I got him before he was able to. Wait, why are you fighting me? 
Oh no, they are, they're trying to help. Or not, never mind. They say we're public enemy number one, they're not gonna believe us. No, we're not, uh... Actually, I, I don't know why I wasn't doing that before. Oh well. Uh, oh, bouncer would be good. Oh yeah, you're right, shit. Uh, where is it? Bouncer, vaporizer. <laughs> Oh, he used the bouncer too. He just spit out a bunch of little balls. Yeah. Gotta hit him before his shield activated. I'm assuming we can't hit him when, when that's going on. And now the tank's after us! I like how you have a shield and, aren't, and don't even feel the need to use it. It's not its not a terribly difficult final boss. Yeah. I, was, I wasn't calling you out or anything. <laughs> like, you were doing fine without it. It's fine. It's extra damage. Oh, I... Charles mentioned liking to uh, just set up all of the auto options oh, at once. Oh, shit. The shield, the killinoids, the mega turrets. Oh, you know what? Killinoids. I, I, I don't know why I haven't been using those. Is that it? Is that really it? Tough boss. No, but Ratchet 3 was the disappointment. I'll have to watch... I don't remember the final ba boss in Deadlocked. This is the real Mr. Fizzwidget. Quark had him tied up in a supply closet all this time. He oh. looks good! Gentlemen, for someone who's been tied up for months. Yeah. It was nothing, or sir. Days? <laughs> How long has this been? <laughs> Unharmed. Right. What do you suppose is wrong with it? Uh, I don't know. Oh, you're it touching it. Months of research and the battery is in backwards. That's how that works. And the silic to the very last. <laughs> Down, boy. I just have to amplify the device with Megacorp's TV transponders, and that should cure the other protopads. It's always that simple. Clay? Yeah. It's okay. I can fix her. He shot her in the back I of the promise. head, execution style. Was that... <laughs> Somehow Clank gets a TV deal out of this. And just smashed the credits. Oh, well, there that, you go. That's it! I can fix her! Credits! John, John Woo. Chuck <laughs> Chris hopped up town. Hover bite. It's a shame we're never gonna get to see the Insomniac Museum. There's some neat stuff in there. Yeah. It's... Let me double check something. So that's, that's, that's the end of the game, it's just, it's okay, we can fix her credits. It kind of ends with a whimper. Yeah. I guess the first game sort of did that as well, and that, not, not to this degree, but... It was kind of an uneventful smash to credits. <laughs> just cut to credits. Oh, sorry. That's it. It's just, your hero gets a kiss, the professor is saved, he says, he says, the actual professor has two lines to let you know he's actually the real one. And then, <laughs> to reveal that Cork was hit the entire time, I did, I never, I, I forgot that that was the twist. Yeah. Cause it's like, you oh. You forgot it was Cork. Yeah, cause, because you gotta, like, get him from a planet again, right? Cause an old villain is here? Yeah. So I think... In three, he like he has a prison so, breakout or what something. What do you like to do for fun? Oh my goodness! Pornhub.com. <laughs> so what did she just like pull up an image I of a of a of a bolt going into a nut? <laughs> Silver it over. So you fellas new here? Wait, you, you employed him? The little baby clean it's like Lelouch. Fears. They gotta keep an eye on him. He's dangerous otherwise. I am personally sporting oh, he's testing the product. Chassis, and there are no tags on my luggage. Okay. Alright then. Catch you later.
Subject 23A. Please report immediately for crotchetizer testing. Well, duty calls. He still he seems to be owning it. Yeah, I just. Oh, I, I test their. In the middle of the credits. Back to credits now. We know kids don't have that long attention spans. So it says... I, I thought that once you access the museum once, you, you could uh, access it again. So I was thinking maybe on my file we can get into it. No. Nope. But, uh, well, I, maybe, I don't know. The, the wiki doesn't mention that. It does say you can also access it from the menu after getting all weapons with all mods. Uh... Which requires all platinum bolts, so, uh... Nope, sorry. No, not gonna happen. There's apparently a way to glitch into it. Oh, really? How? Uh, on Boldan, on the on the grind rail, it is is possible to intentionally get hit and then glide Jim, down with the th what? Jim Ward was a lot of people. Yeah, Roger Bumpus. Yep. The unknown inventor. That's uh, Squidward. Ah. <laughs> There's Stephen Bloom. Stephen J. Bloom. Him, my guest. And Mona Marshall. Proprietary techniques oh. and code. What? Naughty Dog. Wait. They have, oh, so they, they used their they, engine? They based this on, like, Naughty Dog's engine, I guess. For Crash? Or did they outsource the engine to Naughty Dog first? Hmm. Hey, you guys have done platformers oh, like this. Oh, the Naughty Dogs! Naughty Dog and Insomniac were bros. <laughs> Steve Martin. Uh, yeah, you can get hit on a grind rail and glide down. Uh. And, like, access a spot. Boyfriends and pets. No sheep for harm. No, for the most part, the one that was had it coming. All right, fellas, and nice and tight now. So you tested this, right? Oh, Wait, wait. what's the crotchetator <laughs> for? <laughs> we don't know. Let's find oh, out. One more thing. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. <laughs> we know it still works from the next game. You can now go back in time, or you can go on to challenge mode. Yep. So it's another one of those uh, can't save after the boss things. Alas. Check out the specials menu for new features. Cool. Let's check it out. Did you enable challenge? No, you didn't. New features. No, new, new features. What new features? Movies. Is there is there a special movie? No. Yeah. Nope. Excitement. Excite? What's this? We at Megacorp would like to congratulate you on your choice of the Commandomatic body armor and helmet Did combo. We see this? Now that you've had a chance to use it, we'd like to demonstrate some of its most important functions. This, this seems like a uh, menu only thing, yeah. The provides several helpful readouts. This area it's just a UI tutorial. Uh, well, we don't, uh... Yeah, we can, uh, we can, we can load... Like, my file, see if there's stuff there. Yeah. So I don't think I have all the weapons and mods, so we couldn't even access it on, uh, on my file. Yeah. Because the fucking Zodiac and the Rhino. One point... One million and one... You need 2.5 million to see everything in this game. I don't even have the like, ultra armor. No, I, oh, don't, you I have... don't have any of them. I don't even have the clank zapper. Was this, uh... 
I must have been part way through this file. Because I only have a couple of... Mega Tesla barrier! I only have a couple of things. That's the first thing I got is the shield. I guess because I knew it was going to take a long time to, uh... Long time to level up, so I got it first. Also, I'm sure it was cheap. Mega Tetra Bomb gun. You know, only over a million. Mega Mega Rocket! Mega Mega Rocket! Mega Meteor Gun. Ultra Heavy... How's how how good's the ultra heavy like heavy bouncer? These are not as expensive as I thought they were. They're still expensive, but M mega mini nuke one point five million. Oh, was... that must be strong. God, well it's time seven, so it's got a bolt multiplier in uh, this mode. But even so, mega vaporizer. Oh, there are mega versions, or there are uh, new game plus versions of the. Ratchet and Clank 1 weapons. Oh, cool. You still can't level them, but you can get, like, a better version of each the one. The Mega Visible. There it is. One million for the Clank Zapper. Buzz. Maybe it's, like, uh, maybe it's something you can activate, like, the other stuff. It's not a weapon you have to use. And it's passive. Yeah, maybe it's passive. That would explain a lot about it. It has ammo, though. Like, it's just a, a slightly longer range version of the shield. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. For one million, though. The price of the rhino. Come on. <laughs> Way to guarantee we'll never play any of... Get any of the, like... The big... cool weapons, yeah. yeah. Hey, if you spend, like, a ton of time in this game doing absolutely everything, and then go back and grind it all over again, you can afford one of these weapons. <sighs> it's pointless! It is. It does kind of suck. It's like, I'd rather... Oh, jump... Like, you know how... Jump to different parts of the game. Oh, you can just, I, I guess, quickly access a couple of spots. Ah. Uh, random stuff. Spacious. What? What the fuck? Hello? Oh, is this a two-player game? Uh, I, I think? Oh, it's like, oh, I died. So it has black hole physics where it's rotating and I guess you fire at each other. Yeah. With sheep spit. Seems like it. Okay, so they just like, how exit. There we go. Another one. Paintings. Oh, oh. Yeah, let's check it out. When I saw the exterminator, the exterminator ship. Oh, that's like a wep uh, something that was in the two game. Two bone slinger do the thing. I wanted to look really calm right before the battle on the docking platform. By Wes Louis. That sure is a robot. I guess that's like the thugs robot. Maybe yeah. they, uh... It was giving me a lot with doing something in the snow while he saw the snipper standing over Ratchet. Those things suck. S Look how sad Clank looks. Yeah. Uh, ship in space. Oh, that looks cool, actually. I like that. These are the, uh... D here, have, have some desktop backgrounds. They all look pretty good. If I, I, want, I, I would like them in 1080 by... The not... Unknown. Oh, that's who, uh, the... Is it the Unknown Thief, maybe? Yeah. Me who, who did we see in the credits with voice the Unknown something or other? I, I, oh, I, I guess that's it. That's it. How do you, how do you get this stuff? Just random, Christ. randomly appear. Oh, hey, first person mode! Oh, you know, you just gotta clear the game to unlock it? Yeah. Why wouldn't you want to play Ratchet in first person? Oh, does it work? Uh, maybe not the vaporizer. Everything works. It's hey, try, try doing a long jump. Holy shit, it works. It's not unplayable. Can you, uh, can you swing your wrench with the square? Oh. It's just that. Only that. You know what? That's fine. I can't do a jump attack. Oh, but, well, that adds the functionality of a range jump wrench, though. You can't do that at base. Yeah, you that's pretty... Try it? Yeah, sure. I'll, uh, I'll play it with it a little bit. It is a diff it's a slightly different game in first person. It's not unplayable, but I do prefer as a platform to the third person. Yeah. Mode. Oh, bye. Oh, oh, I missed it. Okay. I wonder if uh, you take damage and the UI just pops up for a moment is what happens. Probably. Oh, that... You know what you can't do now, though? You can't do the the box breaker. Yeah, that's that's gonna be an issue. That, that, uh, that, that would make getting money even harder. Uh... 
So, okay, L1 can fire. Good. Is that like a traditional FPS? Uh, or there are. Is are usually it's a it's a trigger. It's yeah. a FPS. Uh, functions okay. Uh. It's not necessarily doesn't necessarily make for a good FPS game, but it does. It's not designed for it. No, it does because... transfer into an FPS game. It's weird that they make the wrench like that because even FPS games usually have a traditional. Uh... Oh, get the wallop around. Ooh. They still have a melee weapon. Oh, that looks weird. <laughs> that is so weird. <laughs> the lazy punch. Yeah. I wonder what Ratchet's... Oh, this would be a good boundary break. I wonder if that, if uh, She Says did this. Of what Ratchet's model looks like when you're playing in first-person mode. Do you think it's like Metroid and it's just his hand floating there? Was that what it was for uh, for Metroid Prime? Yeah, the, the model itself. There's no model. <laughs> it's just a camera and a hand. That's what it was for... Uh, so... That's what the model was for... Uh, for Jurassic Park Trespasser as well. It was uh, just one arm and, a, and like a pair of tits. Yeah. Because you look down at, at your uh, at your tattoo to see how much health you got left. Okay. Yeah. How long is your tattoo. dragon tattoo? It was a hard tattoo, but, but yeah, basically that. Oh, what's swimming gonna be like? So this would make it the game a lot harder to uh, maybe you can. I don't think you can swim. You can in this. Yeah. Okay. I thought maybe this was a pool of water you couldn't swim in. So this would make the game more difficult just for the fact that you can't see enemies coming behind you. No, you did, this game would be incredibly difficult like that. So tune in next time for our Ratchet & Clank 2 Challenge Mode first person stream. <laughs> nah. Well, I'd rather start the third, the next game to be yeah, honest. There's more, there's more game to get to. Oh wow, what? Did you see that shit? Yeah, it's like glitching. The game glitched out for a second. I don't know if I could play this entire game like this. No, the, the, the killer is not having the box breaker. Especially... Yeah. Especially in this game where you need every bolt you can get just to afford basic shit. Yeah. Clear this room out. Oh wow. Okay, there it goes. There's the... I wonder if I just have no armor on this file. Because I spent all my money on weapons. Yeah, you kind of. I realized playing this game is that you kind of need armor. Like I do, you can do without it if you're. You good either enough. get you either either use your shields and, and be really frugal, or you get armor and not really worry about it all that much. Which is weird because when in like a game like Smash, I'm the guy who plays the heavy and relies on like taking and tanking a bunch of hits. In a game like th in th in this game at least, my strategy is just to like dodge everything. Yeah. Is this? Yeah, this game was not designed for uh, for like FPSs. I'm sure they're like, hey, maybe you should make it an FPS, and then they they like they hack together a quick mode like that, and they're like, nah, change our minds, we're not doing FPS, and they just kept it. Was this uh, was this foreshadowing of the the gradual more shootery direction the series would take? <laughs> Maybe first person is available from the start in uh, three. We'll have I, to check. I'll try it when uh, on like. Well, not no, that we should play the whole game like that. No, or anything, I was thinking like I could do it first person. You do it third person. And we'll see how it compares. We'll see if it's there. I, <laughs> I hope. I hope that person wasn't like full of shit and Deadlock can be played multiplayer and I just never knew about it. Oh, God, if that game can be played multiplayer, that'd be that'd be awesome. I I doubt it, but that'd be cool. So we'll see when we get to that. Person wasn't full of shit. Well, we'll see if he's full of shit when we get to it. So I mean, that's our Ratchet & Clank 2. We'll start three That eventually. was pretty quick. How long it was, was it? It was like five streams? Maybe six? Yeah, I, I'm wondering how long this video was. Oh, uh, a little over two hours. Okay, that's not, that's not bad. Alright, that's it for us today, though. Alright. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Uh, see you next time.